everyone. In this issue we will talk about the unique Soviet fire truck, which is now abandoned and just stands in the Aviation Museum in Kiev. Perhaps in the future it will be restored and will be used as an exhibit in this museum. Firefighting airport car designed for fire and rescue service at the airfields. It provides fire extinguishing in airplanes and helicopters, evacuation of passengers and crew members from crashed airplanes, as well as fire extinguishing at sites near airports. Maz 543AA60 was released in 1973. It has a water tank of 11,000 liters and a further tank for 800 liters. The car was equipped with a specially designed 60 horsepower pump. Between the cabins on the special wreck there was a Lafette water canyon, which had a remote control with a hydraulic drive. Since 1976, this model was produced on the chassis of the Maz 7310. The level of fire protection of airfields imposed a number of specific requirements. Firstly, because of the need to rescue people during aircraft accidents and extinguishing fires on them. At the aerodromes there is a need to extinguish burning spilled fuel both under the fuselages of aircraft, and on the runway, and even outside it. Sometimes it becomes necessary to cover the runway with a layer of air mechanical foam to facilitate the landing of planes in distress. Subscribe to the channel, leave your comments and click on the bell. See you soon, friends.